Good morning. Today we are in RB Marine. Not yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Um, we are heading off to Cape to get some fuel and then we are going to get underway to somewhere. Yeah. Luna's a little unwell because yeah. she did something that wasn't particularly sensible, was it? No, it wasn't sensible. Party too hard. She partied too hard on arrival to the boat and now she's a little bit poorly. But hopefully she'll feel better soon. Oh. And you're just happy. Hi. Yeah. I'm the star of this show. We brought a deck bed to the boat. Chris is currently trying to um, yoga in it. I'm not really sure. <laughs> Kidding. He's just um, fluffing out the mattress inside so it um, sits neatly and nicely. But it's oh, looking no, really good. <laughs> and we made it out of the same vinyl that we've made our cockpit cushions, which are a little bit filthy right now from dogs. But hey, <laughs> we're getting there. That big line across was the foam tiles not sitting together. Mm -hmm. They were like, Bleh. so this should be better, more better. -er. So that's the bed up. We've got a lot of cover for it as well. It's going to sit on top of it. It's going to be snapped into place. Yeah. But underneath it, we have. Oh, hey, it's a really good fit. Deck bed galore. Okay, we are pretty much good to go now. So we're gonna let off the mooring and get underway. Adrian's new boat looking quite fine. Yes! In case message, you are the queen of the galley. Mm -hmm. Of course, it's granted. Thank you. Get out my face! <laughs> you guys are weird. Really party too hard. She took a legal starfish, and now she's had a bad hangover at slack. because there's literally no wind. I think there's about a knot, knot and a half. If we're lucky, gusting an entire three. Wild. So we are just arriving in Cape Marina. We are gonna get some fuel before we head out. So here, quick fuel break, a snack, and then we're back underway.
probably quite a lot. <laughs> I don't know. I just I just threw a lot in. <laughs> Hope for the best. I've never had a problem with bug. We got fuel and now we're gonna get underway to wherever Adrian's going. We'll go there. So I we're think thinking we're... about going through the Kyles, maybe uh, St. Ninian's Bay, that sort of area is where we're planning. So we'll see, we'll we see where the wind takes us or lack off because there's still no wind. out but there's literally no wind there's a knot sometimes a knot and a half um, so there's absolutely no sailing to be done today so on we go with motoring again <laughs> Paulina is still sleeping uh, off whatever is bugging her her tummy has settled thankfully but she's just like an easy and resting, which is very unlike Luna. Ah, oh, Hachi. It's very unlike her. Hey, buddy. You look very dashing. He's a handsome boy. Do you remember how he used to speak whale? Hello. Hello. So a decision has been made. We are going to St. Ninian's Bay. Um, I think Adrian and Nick have just arrived there. We are a couple of hours behind, not even a couple of hours. Um, we're arriving in the next hour or so, and then we're gonna go and have a barbecue on a beach because it is a little bit cloudy, but it's nice and calm and there's no wind and it's just lovely. So we're gonna go have drinks, wine, and a barbecue, so. Doggies love your new pad. Ah, uh, they do. <laughs> Is this a good place to be? Yeah. Oh, big stretch. <laughs> we have arrived in Sydney and Spain. Um, Adrian and Nick are already here. I'm just getting ready to anchor. And then it's barbecue time. Are you excited for a barbecue for dinner, Mimsy? Huh? Yeah. You looking forward to dinner? Yeah. Yep. Good, yeah. Shackled not, don't take it all 
Okay, we are anchored, now off to make some food, prep things, and then we're gonna go and get some dinner. we got the dinghy out to the shore and it's so shallow that um, we can't really get in and Chris has been for how a while I, How come I always end up pulling us with my feet wet? It's because I don't wear Crocs so it's really just your back. Pull it fam, pull it! Get out of here! Right, we're gonna have to walk this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I guess I better get out in my poor trainers. This is coming back to get me. That's love. <laughs> this is like a scene out of Interstellar. There's gonna be like a big tidal wave coming crashes or something like that. Either. <laughs> right, come on then. No. <laughs> Not what I imagined this to be. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is cold. Okay, the water is not as warm as one might imagine in May. I'll be in here one more time, see what happens. We've been watching the low deck, suggest you all get into it. Yeah. Tide is still going out, so it's probably gonna drop by another meter or so. So I think we're gonna have quite a walk back to the dinghy. Bear in mind, bearing in mind that the dinghy is there and Chris and Jasper are all the way up there on the beach. I'm only about halfway there, so it's gonna be a nice walk. Thankfully, it's not meant to be, it's not meant to be windy or cold or anything, so it's gonna be a nice evening. But if we do need anything from the boat, and if we have forgotten anything from the boat, this is gonna be painful. Nick and Adrian in the distance making their way across the well a mile of beach <laughs> <laughs> we 
Should we go and um, pick Adrian up? And, uh, you know, whack him over his shoulder. <laughs> Bring them both in. Oh, I want to watch him suffer. <laughs> <laughs> you know, he's going to watch us and be like, yeah, revenge will be sweet. Did you just burp while I'm filming? You're disgusting. Right, I don't want anyone to act like this was a chore when they arrived. We just had to walk miles up the sandy beach. I had to get wet, I had to lift Daria, I had to lift Jasper, I had to lift all the stuff up the beach, but I'm gonna like pretend to Adrian like, nah, this was a piece of piss. So when they arrive, just be like, ah, oh, nah. Lovely. Beautiful place, location. Right? Beautiful location. We're cool. Hey, do you want anything? Do you want a barbecue? Do you want a Pims? Because we forgot our plate. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna have to knit back and get the plates. But I'll be like sprinting down the beach into the dinghy half a mile of wading through this much water. <laughs> Maybe back in 90 seconds. <laughs> yeah. Hey, do you like my barbecue? Beautiful setup. What a rock arrangement. What beautiful crocs you have. All the better for sprinting down the beach to pick up the plates. <laughs> <laughs> you can bring my sandals while you're at it. I thought you'd say that. Away. Kite's finally coming in. Yeah. 